The World Health Organization announced Monday that it's suspending a trial of hydroxychloroquine in treating COVID-19, saying fears of the drug's potential danger are causing it to err on the side of caution. Despite those warnings, Sanford Avera and Monument Health are continuing with their clinic trial of the drug. Kellyland's Don Jorgensen tells us why. Hydroxychloroquine was first touted as a possible drug that might fight coronavirus. That's why all three major health systems in South Dakota wanted to conduct a statewide clinical trial to study the effects of the drug often used to treat malaria. We'll give some people placebo, some people hydroxychloroquine, and we'll measure outcomes. And we'll be able to say yes or no. I'm not invested in if it works or if it doesn't work. What I want to know is an answer so that we can move forward. The study got underway on May 14th, and so far, only a handful of patients have been a part of it. The reason why we need to continue this trial, and while this trial is so important, it's because it's at a very different stage of the illness. Much of the data that we've seen where it's shown hydroxyl has proven to be harmful or not have any benefit has been on those individuals that are very sick with the disease and are in the hospital. The study will monitor and track those who have been exposed to the virus for 45 days. The health systems say that there are no results as of yet to determine if hydroxychloroquine is effective in the fight against COVID-19. Don Jorgensen, Land News. If anyone has questions about the clinical trial, you should call Sanford Health.